Okay, we will have to be the first to pull out because we're the hold up to everyone. But we can't leave until for Mark and Joni. So we're all set up. We're traveling with a full tank of fresh water, half a tank of waste, and half a tank of gray. So I think we're at our weight limit. Not a good thing, actually. I'm kind of worried about the tires. So everyone's packing up, getting ready to leave. And we're going to try the dash cam to see how that works. So hopefully we can get a dash cam episode of driving up to Banff, which is our next stop. And we're three, three, we're four days, three nights there without water and sewer. We are in Banff and it has been a good day. My, my navigator wasn't navigating so we missed the gas station and then he wasn't telling me which lane to be on. So there was a little bit of yelling <laughs> this morning and I wasn't the one, I was the one yelling, not receiving it. So I do have to apologize to him later. He's over there frowning. <laughs> All right, but we are in Vamp. It is a lovely, it's parallel parking. Well, we just pulled in. We got here early. We pulled right in. And then there's a RV in the middle who had to parallel park. And then our tail gunner over there at the very end. So there's three spaces that you kind of, hopefully you get one in the ends that you can just pull through. So we got to pull through. When we do come back, it's, I believe I need to look at the paperwork, it's a village too. Same, same village, except it's on the other side where they have sewer hookups. And here they don't have sewer, water, they just have electrical we had to fill up our fresh water tank and I dumped for the very first time different episode okay we again we're here at Banff it's absolutely gorgeous let me pan around behind me at this beautiful mountain uh, tomorrow we're taking a bus tour which is a different episode so this is just uh, getting to Banff and I'm still a little bit cranky. In Filipino, I've got really bad samango, which is the little devil that lives, with the, that lives inside of everyone. And we have wildlife here. There has been chipmunks and squirrels that live in these holes in the ground. You know, sh I just got a mosquito bite. <laughs> I'm out here in the wilderness. We're in the wilderness. I need to go. I need to put on some mosquito repellent. More importantly, I need a nap. It's gorgeous out here. We're parked in within the Rocky Mountains, Canadian Rocky Mountains, but Rocky Mountains. <sighs> There's Walter, talking to you people. He's gonna leave me alone now so I can take a nap. Earlier, before my nap and my pieces of bread, I was a little bit cranky. And I was more upset with Walter than anything else. So, I feel better now. I'm completely sprayed up with DEET. There are mosquitoes here. So I'm trying to get to trying to get to where the showers are. I want to see what the shower situation is. 
because we only have electric. It is 50 amp. However, there's no water, there's no sewer. So, no shower. You can't use the shower inside of Wanda. So they do have complete hookup facilities here, but it's on the other side. And I'm sure it gets booked up. Because I booked it months ahead, months ago. And I don't even remember how much I paid for it. Look at this, they have nice cabins. They have cabins. Oh, they look like duplexes. Three-story duplexes. Lots of children. I don't like all these freaking children. Okay, I did find the shower facilities. It's not too far from where we're at. It is definitely within walking distance. However, it's disgusting. Oh dear Lord. I may not shower for three days. Or, we might check into a hotel. There are several hotels in this, in Banff. We will see. <laughs> so, more later. Don't know if I'm just not going to shower at all. Because right now I smell like DEET. And I'm going to smell like DEET probably the entire trip. So I may never shower again. <laughs> that was disgusting. <laughs> well, it doesn't smell. It was just... Dirty. And people, oh, people are disgusting. Okay, there's trash cans. Trash cans are over here. And there we are. That rig is John and Irene. Love them. They are great people. And very majestic. Very majestic views. Loving it here. The views are incredible. This, isn't this incredible? Love it. Okay, there is a private just within the tour group itself. It's called the cluster and it's photos that we're just sharing amongst each other. It's not going out in the public. And I want to introduce you to the woman who set it up. Her name is Myra. <laughs> Only if I have her permission. Yes. yes. Okay. She said yes. This is Myra. Hi there. She's incredible. <laughs> I love the fact that she set up this website for us to share photos with each other. Wonderful woman. All right. Here we are at the bus stop. Right now, according to this sign, it's free going out but we gotta pay to come back here and the last bus is i think 11 o'clock and that's way too late for us so we're just gonna have dinner this is cute they actually tell you what the money is so we are an adult which is two dollars i think they call this a loon so we are here and we want to go here to Buffalo Street. There's a steakhouse there with four and a half stars. Now, because of the shower situation, we might be looking into renting a cabin just for the bathroom usage. And then passing around the key to everyone in the caravan. It's an option that we actually have already considered. We shall see, or I just don't shower for the next two, three days. Actually, <laughs> here we are in downtown. Where are we again? Banff. Banff, and we're eating at Chuck's Steakhouse. This town is adorable. It's a tourist trap. The adorable. whole town is a tourist trap. Look at this. We have eight seconds, so we're not oh, going. Please. We're not going. Okay, whole town, tourist route, all the way down, as far as you can see. 
see this. It's a four-way crosswalk. Just like in Japan. This is great. <laughs> Alright, here we are in Banff. We just finished eating over at... What is that steakhouse called? Chuck's. Chuck's Steakhouse over there in the corner. Really good food. Colby, Colton, waiter. He was so funny. Adorable. Adorable little kid. Sunset here in Banff. Where is it? I oh, can't see the sunset. It's over gone. there. It's gone. We're at twilight. It's now 9.30. Can't believe the sunsets here. It's absolutely gorgeous. This mountain. Beautiful mountain top. By the way, his name was Colin. Colin. Adorable little kid. Nice kid. Oh, smell that pine. Okay, we're going to finish this off and vamp. We have stayed several nights here at Tunnel Mountain Village 2 Campground. And my impressions of this part of the park, they need to add more gravel here on this area because there's too much dirt. And it is a 50 amp, which is nice. However, there is no water and sewer. We will be staying here again in two months when we come back at this area over here on this side. And this side has water, sewer, and electric. So I'll probably like that side better. There are a lot of mosquitoes here. So make sure you have 100% deep bug repellent. Uh, that is what I've been using. And the mosquitoes buzz around me, but they don't land on me. It's amazing. <laughs> so I only have a couple of bites, and that was before I sprayed on the DEET. We'll see you in the next RV park. Bye. Mm -hmm.